从争端摩擦、多轮谈判，再到签署第一阶段经贸协议，中美经贸关系自2018年以来经历诸多挑战和不确定。美中经贸关系应如何再挂钩？美中贸易全国委员会会长克伦格·艾伦近日接受中新社东西问独家专访。Let's look first at overall global trade policy, because trade policy with regard to China is one piece of global trade. And I think their USTR has really not articulated coherent、uh, strategy. Uh, overall, thus far,、uh, there have been a few notable successes. The administration has articulated a Indo-Pacific economic strategy, but with no details. So we're waiting on that. Vis-a-vis -vis trade policy with regard to China, when Joe Biden was campaigning for president before the election, he spoke very much about how negative the tariffs were. And how they hurt American workers and families. The bilateral discussions to reduce the tariffs or eliminate them or address other outstanding market access issues seem to be not happening. Let me start again at the global level because I think it's really notable that Chinese、uh, trade negotiators have been very busy and very successful. I think that RCEP agreement. Is extremely important. Also, I'd like to compliment the decision made by China to join CPTPP. I think that that's very important. I think it's a really good sign, and I congratulate. Vis-a-vis、um, -vis bilateral policy,、um, I think that we see very similar things in Beijing and in Washington, and that is active decoupling、uh, from both governments、uh, who wish to. Reduce any dependency upon、uh, the other,、um, especially for strategic、uh, goods or, or goods that might be、uh, strategic. We do need confidence-building measures, and、uh, we would encourage, for example, reduction of tariffs as a confidence-building measure, especially in this time of inflation.、Uh, it would be really a smart thing to do,、um, but. I think that both governments have national security concerns, right? I, I mean, we should accept that. Uh, uh, but if so, let's define the national security concerns, and then、um, put a ring around it,、uh, and allow WTO implementation across everything else. I think that if、uh, the two leaders said that they wish to work through their economic differences、uh, to remove the tariffs. And return to a normal trading relationship. That would be excellent. But right now, emotion is very high. But we should keep in mind that that the U.S. and China have to live with each other for the long term. 